Welcome back traders. Today I might sound a little bit weird. I'm in my car once more so the audio might be off. I apologize for that. But this just has to be covered and I don't think I'm going to have any time any other uh, throughout the day to do this. So this is the Cypher Mining Warrants. I was going to wait to cover this until later but today was such a monumentous move on it that I just have to talk about it. I was actually in this um, play as of Friday last week. I, I sold out today because the like the increase was just too much in one day for me to not sell, and it's already starting to bleed off. Anyways, so the, the, the warrants, you can see, is represented by this blue line here, and the underlying stock is represented by this light blue line. In fact, can I change Anyways. that? The underlying stock here is represented in orange. So today, Cypher Mining went up. 21.83%. It's basically, and it's bleeding off from there. At one point it was, I mean, even right here, what was that? Slightly over 20%. And at that time, the warrant was up over 74% on the day. It's still up over 35%. And in after hours, if you look at the after hours, let me bring it up as in here, and the after hours, it's up another 21% on the day. But the warrants, so what is a warrant? A warrant on a stock is Basically, you're purchasing a contract to execute the purchasing of the underlying shares at a certain price by a certain date. So in this case, you buy a cipher mining warrant for price of, what is it, currently a dollar. And that guarantees you the right to buy cipher mining um, stock, underlying stock for $11.50 by the date of August 26th, 2026. So that's when they expire. That's that's when you execute them by. Uh, now, so the way that is related to the stock price is the stock price is currently, I think it's like, how much is the current stock? It's raining, probably hear that. That's not good. I don't have an umbrella today. So the Cypher stock is actually trading for $3.14 right now. Yesterday, uh, it was trading for two dollars and fifty cents. So you see that big rise up. That big rise up was an exponential move on the warrants. So the closer cipher mining gets to eleven dollars and fifty cents, the more these warrants are worth by an exponential amount. As you can see here, it went up twenty percent, but the warrants went up seventy percent. Uh, they did bleed off. And I sold it somewhere, I don't know, around sixty percent up or something, and I just cut it loose because that was too much in one day. Um, and the reason that happened. The reason that happened is because of this. Cypher Mining purchases 7.1 exo hash of new miners. This is the exact same news that BitFarms got before it absolutely took off by hundreds of percent. So I'm expecting a similar move here. And I'm looking at the miners trying to get at the at the warrants to try to get back in. Let me find the price. To try to get back in. I'd like to see it maybe come back into the 70s or 60s before I am interested once more, but I'm, I don't know if I'll get the chance with it soaring so much. So I'm not going to FOMO, I'm waiting. If it doesn't go to my price, I just won't get in and I'll just wait. Cypher Mining is looking at doubling their hash rate from 7.2 to 14.4 or something, 14.1, so slightly less than doubling, but they also have the option to purchase 8.7 exo hash more later on, which is the exact same deal that Bid Farms did with a company before to buy these exact these exact same miners. So I'm expecting Cypher to have a pretty big blow off here pretty quick, pretty soon, based off of that news and off of the movement of the stock. Um, this is great. That's what the warrants are. So the warrant is just the right for you to purchase a stock at a certain value by a certain date. The closer the stock value gets to that price, that executable price, the higher the value of the warrants are, they trade just like stocks. So you just buy shares of them and then you sell them the same way you would sell stocks. Um, again, this is not financial advice to buy, sell, or hold any any assets of any kind. Uh, it's just the information about what the warrant is, how it is moving in relation to the stock price of Cypher Mining, and, and why it's moving today, all days. Uh, that's just a quick update I wanted to get out there today while I had the opportunity. Uh, it was a huge day, as you saw at one point. It was up 80% just on the day. 80% on the day. That's insane. 
Uh, I didn't quite get that much. I got like a 30% move before. I was like, this is too much. And sold out and it went way higher. So I was a bit upset about that. It's coming back down to about the price I sold it at. But it didn't. Uh, I shouldn't even say that. It didn't because it, it almost got back to the price I sold it at. And then it launched in after hours again. So uh, I don't know if Cypher, what's Cypher doing in after hours right now? Let's see. Cypher in after hours, it's grinding up just a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. We'll probably see this one hit four five bucks here in the next few days maybe if it follows a similar trajectory that bitforms did after it released that huge news of buying that many miners almost the same amount of miners honestly uh, so they got a very similar deal and that's pretty great so anyways that's what's happening with cypher mining and the cypher mining warrants today uh they don't trade on every platform i know weeble doesn't have them uh i know schwab does have it uh there's Probably some others that do have it and don't. You, you just have to check your broker to see if it has it. If that's something you're interested in looking at. They, they are pretty intense, though. Like, they move really fast. So, like, it's pretty easy to lose money with them. So, exercise caution, of course. But anyways, please like, comment, and subscribe. And have a profitable day.